Hi, my name is Colton Hero. I'm a quarterback from Centerville, Virginia, FBU, Maryland. A lot of the spread offense was displayed during practice this week. Are we going to see that? Will Colton Rowe come out throwing? Colton Rowe will take this now. They're in Colton the pistol. Rowe. He's going to throw the football. Deep pass. And this one's caught. Tyler Bird for a touchdown. How about that? They're in the pistol with Manny Johnson behind Colton Rowe. Tyler Bird gets the separation. West set back in some zone. And Bird able to streak down and make the grab. Colton Rowe. More pennies for passes on that nice touchdown throw. Yeah, a lot of yards there for 39 yard touchdown strike from Colton Rowe. Second down and 10 for the Eastern Stars. Again in the pistol. Out of the pistol. There's the pass. This one's caught by Bird again. Tyler Bird. Blankenship to punt it away on fourth down. And five. Trent Irwin fields at his 38. Irwin across the 40 to the 45 to the 48 yard line. Nice return again by Trent Irwin as the quarterback, Colton Rowe, got down to make the stop. You like to see your quarterbacks mix it up. In fact, Rowe getting congratulated on the near sideline. Love to get down and make the hit. What quarterback doesn't? That's a good sign of a leader right there, and Colton Rowe getting down to make the play. Six and a half minutes to play in the first half. The East with the football with a 7-0 lead in this youth bowl. The best from around America on Huddle Up. Colton Rowe back to throw. Rowe firing its tip. Johnson catches it anyway. Manny Johnson on the run in the secondary. Manny Johnson to the 50. On that far sideline goes Manny Johnson. They're not going to catch Manny Johnson. Touchdown for the East. 84 yards. Colton Rowe to Manny Johnson. Johnson catches this deflection off of as Rowe is hit as he throws it. Tremendous heat on the quarterback, Rowe. And Colton Rowe, he's accruing those passing yards. While well, we're in Texas, you think of Colt McCoy. Now we're still in Texas, and you think of Colton Rowe, who's thrown a couple scores today. Centerville, Virginia native, and uh, he's made the big play. Colton Rowe has thrown two touchdowns in this opening half. Colton Rowe has three receivers to his right. One of them again starts in motion. And he's thrown back to the left for Bird. They run the same type of setup as the play before, except it's a fake. And then you get Bird streaking down the sideline on all the way they did when they had the opening score. The electrifying Tyler Bird to the near side. But Rose going back the other way. Ooh. A crashing <laughs> hit over the middle on a ball intended for Elijah Trey Boyd. Colton Rowe on this fourth down play. Third down and nine. Down to five on the play clock. Rowe made a quick decision. The pocket was collapsing. Still only 14-6, Neil. It seems like it's a much greater lead mm -hmm. than that, doesn't it? Let's see what Trent Irwin can do as he fields at the 36. Look out here with Trent Irwin. Middle of the field. Has operating room. 50. 45. 40. Still going to the 35-yard line. Trent Irwin. You cannot arm tackle Trent Irwin. Who made the tackle? Colton Rowe. Second down, That's I think Cole's done it, right? I like the quarterback that will stick his nose in there and make a tackle or two. And it's come down to the final 58 seconds. Probably Matty Johnson. Remember they have Rasheed Jones, but they're going to go 
with Manny, bouncing outside. Manny Jones running down the sideline and in for a touchdown with 50 seconds left. A 16-yard touchdown run by Manny Johnson. And the East reclaims the lead 20 to 14. Trying to build that lead to 21-14 with 49 seconds left. A dramatic touchdown run by Manny Johnson. And he's got it. I'll tell you who's confident right now is Colton Rowe. He's gone down. He's hitting every shoulder on the sideline of his teammates on the east side. The East has this football game won. They celebrate 21 to 14 for the East. What a wonderful seventh grade youth bowl game. And you can see the jubilation of the East. All in all, a well played seventh grade youth bowl presented by FBU. These are some names to remember, and that's why we like to say on Huddle Up, uh, we're watching the stars of tomorrow today, and we saw that today.